Good evening and welcome to the benefits of Canterbury, St Dunstan, St Mildred and St Peter where you join us for our service of night prayer or Compline on Friday the 18th of August 2023. My name is John Morrison and I'm standing in for our rector, the Reverend Joe Richards and our curate, the Reverend Jenny Walpole. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be for ever. Amen. Alleluia. Before the ending of the day, creator of the world, we pray, that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight, from fears and terrors of the night. Tread underfoot our deadly foe that we no sinful thought may know. O Father, that we ask be done through Jesus Christ, your only Son, and Holy Spirit by whose breath our souls are raised to life from death. Our refrain for Psalm 139, verses 1 to 18, is Search me out, O God, and know my heart. Search me out, O God, and know my heart. O Lord, you have searched me out and known me. You know my sitting down and my rising up. You discern my thoughts from afar. You mark out my journeys and my resting place. You are acquainted with all my ways. For there is not a word on my tongue, but you, O Lord, know it altogether. You encompass me behind and before, and lay your hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me, so high that I cannot attain it. Search me out, O God, and know my heart. Where can I go then from your spirit, or where can I flee from your presence? If I climb up to heaven, you are there. If I make the grave my bed, you are there also. If I take the wings of the morning and dwell in the uttermost parts of the sea, even there your hand shall lead me, your right hand hold me fast. If I say, surely the darkness will cover me and the light around me turn to night, even darkness is no darkness to you. The night is as clear as the day. Darkness and light to you are both alike. Search me out, O God, and know my heart. For you yourself created my inmost parts. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I thank you, for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvellous are your works, my soul knows well. My frame was not hidden from you when I was made in secret and woven in the depths of the earth. Your eyes beheld my form as yet unfinished. Already in your book were all my members written. As day by day they were fashioned, when as yet there were none of them. How deep are your counsels to me, O God! How great is the sum of them! If I count them, they are more in number than the sand, and at the end I am still in your presence. Search me out, O God, and know my heart. Creator God, may every breath we take be for your glory. May every footstep show you as our way. That trusting in your presence in this world, we may beyond this life still be with you, where you are alive and reign for ever and ever. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. 
God has destined us not for wrath, but for obtaining salvation through our Lord Jesus Christ, who died for us. So whether we are awake or asleep, we may live with him. 1 Thessalonians 5 verses 9 and 10. Our responsory. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth, I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Our Gospel canticle this evening is the Nunc Dimittis, Song of Simeon. Save us, O Lord, while waking and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be for ever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep may rest in peace. Gracious God, we thank you for this past week, for all the joys of meeting with members of our Christian community and for being able, whenever we can, to bring the good news of Jesus Christ to the hearts of all those we meet. We pray for those who are bereaved. We pray for those who are waiting with those who are dying and we pray for those who are dying that they all may receive the grace and comfort that you have promised us through our Lord Jesus Christ. Lord in your mercy hear our prayer. Lord Jesus Christ Son of the living God who at this evening hour lay in the tomb and so hallowed the grave to be a bed of hope for all who put their trust in you. Give us such sorrow as our, for our sins, which were the cause of your passion, that when our bodies lie in the dust, our souls may live with you forever. Amen. Let us pray with confidence as our Saviour has taught us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep, for you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. Come with the dawning of the day and make yourself known to us. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Thank you for joining us this evening for our night prayer compline. My colleague, uh, the rector, uh, the Reverend Joe Richards, will be with you on Monday morning for morning prayer at nine o'clock and for evening prayer at 6 p.m. If you are local, do remember our churches are open this weekend. Have a very good weekend. Bye for now.